Hello, Mrs. Carver and my fellow students. My name is Sam Booker, and I live in Richmond, Virginia. All my life, I have considered myself an artist. An artist can have many names, be it a musician, a painter, or a photographer. And an artist can express himself through many different media. I believe that every aspiring artist should sample a vast array of different media to better understand himself and become better equipped to express himself. Most artists will pick a favorite medium primarily to express themselves with, and for the longest time, my favorite medium to express myself with was the culinary arts. I've always enjoyed experimenting with different cuisines, and to this day, I still push myself to think outside of convention whenever I create a dish. For the longest time, I wanted to devote my career to become an accomplished chef and establish my name in the world of the culinary arts. However, recently, my goal has changed from becoming a chef to becoming a welder. The moment I decided to change my career happened while I was watching a race on TV. When I noticed the intricate detail involved in crafting an automobile, I stood up and said, I want to build a dune buggy. In that moment, I had finally cleared my mind of any anxiety about what life I would lead in the future. I knew I couldn't give up an art for the longest time that was so dear to me, but I realized that pursuing a career as a chef might be the most difficult path I could ever choose for myself. I decided to make cooking a hobby that I could expand upon in my own time rather than letting it become my work. I chose this because I feared if I ever began to hate my work as a chef, my creativity in that field would diminish. I think an artist's worst fear is to come to hate what he creates. And if I know anything about work, it's that I hate working. I decided that if I ever came to hate my job, I would rather it not be the thing I love most, cooking. Now, I am not looking into a career in welding with the expectation that I will undoubtedly hate it, but rather I feel I am preserving my hobby of cooking as something I will never have to worry about becoming a burden hanging over me. I am still an artist, and I can express my artistic vision through the craft of welding, cooking, carpentry, or whatever else I choose to pursue. To sum it up, I simply want to keep my work and my greatest passion as two separate facets of my life for the sake of variety and so I will have something to look forward to if ever my mood sours.